Well, AI has the potential to uh, enhance processes and improve efficiency. And for that to, to be sustained, you have to have trust within um, that technology. Uh, otherwise, you know, you can have all the technology in the world, but if it's not adopted and applied, you don't reap the rewards. I think senior leaders should remember here that um, there are defined processes that are best considered best practice around the world in regards to data science, the development of machine learning algorithms. ML Ops, the machine learning operation, is, is a really critical part of this, which develops that trust mechanism for people to be able to have confidence in what the models are outputting. This can be by putting things through a DevOps process, which is where you de develop, test, and then put the models into production. And this allows us to have transparency and explainability throughout that whole process. Model monitoring um, and ease of access of the key performance metrics of these models so that the senior stakeholders can get a good feel for how they're performing over time. I think generative AI um, poses a challenge to organisations because a trust does need to be built over time and if we don't educate finance departments on the best use of generative AI, how prompt engineering works and how you can really extract good information or bad information and I think it comes back to one of the tenets of the ACCA qualification which is professional scepticism when you're utilising these tools. Yes, yeah, so part of the um, cross-functional collaboration and communication piece um, is it's critical to have governance frameworks in place uh, defining you know, roles and responsibilities to ensure that you know, that trust is maintained. In terms of the outputs, um, I guess it was critical to retain uh, human judgment and human decision making uh, because ultimately the machine learning model is hopefully generating an output that is more accurate than other, other methods but the, the, the true objective is to achieve better decision making for better business outcomes. And what's really important is understanding the data lineage here. How is the data required? How is it maintained? Um, and what regular quality checks are put in place? So the technical understanding that finance professionals would require um, would be contextual depending on the organisation and the other resources that are available. So I think, for me, the most important thing has been the foundation in the ethics and the governance that we learn throughout our process of uh, education with the ACCA. The AI and ML space is moving so quickly and often governance in an industry is struggling to catch up with that pace. 